the middleweight matchup between Damage and Pride Superstar, Vanderlei Silva. Our Tale of the Tape is brought to you by Boost Mobile. Once again, with our official introductions for this battle, the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, by way of Curitiba, Brazil. The ex-murderer, Vanderlei Silva. And now, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Newark, New Jersey. Damage Sheets. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Mario Yamasaki. Mario Yamasaki, our referee. Mike Goldberg alongside my partner Joe Rogan. Here you go, guys. Vanderlei Silva, damage. Round one is underway. Is there a meaner looking dude before a fight than Vanderlei Silva? No, not with that cool ass head tattoo. No. I'm gonna get me one of those. Yeah, I think you should right now. You're about ready for one. <laughs> Some vicious kicks. Man, really torquing the body on those hooks. Wow, that right hand. Oh, nice left and a right. Combination, left, right. Oh, answered by a big body shot. Both men exchanging. Big head kick. Keep moving to the outside. Beautiful head kick there. Leg kicks. He's got the clinch. He's got his opponent up towards the fence. Under three minutes now. Body shots when you're in there tight. Keep going. <laughs> Try to get a take down if you can. Get him backing up and make him better. Looks like damage is cut here, Mike. Stand that right on. That cut on damage has really opened up. Look at the battle for control here. Shot. Hey, Boom. Stay busy. And now Silva is cut open. He's really landing those short punches inside, Mike. Is taking a beating. Head oh, kick. that one wobbled him. Oh, big right hand. He's down. Vicious round and pound. Round. The referee has stopped the fight. Wow, what a display. Damage finishes the fight. Here we see it one more time.
Look at it from this angle. Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 36 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO, Damage Sheets. Damage reigns supreme. Up between Damage and the longtime ruler of the middleweight division, Rich Franklin. Rich Franklin making his way to the octagon, and he has this crowd fired up. Rich Franklin is a well-rounded fighter with a ton of heart. He is a hard worker in the gym and always shows up in tremendous shape with a solid game plan. He throws heavy hands and displays good technique in every single aspect. Damage. Set to enter the world famous octagon once again. This guy is known for his aggressive style and overwhelming pace. He always pushes forward, always attacking, and I don't think we've ever seen him have a boring match, Mike. He comes out to fight every time, and you can hear the crowd loves him for it. Our tale of the day is brought to you by the only motorcycles worthy of being in the octagon, Harley Davidson. And now, with the official introductions, the veteran voice of the Octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a freestyle fighter. He stands six feet, one inch tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Cincinnati, Ohio. He is the former UFC middleweight champion, Rich Ace! Right, right. And now, fighting out of the red corner, this man is a boxer. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Newark, New Jersey, Damage Sheets! And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Josh Rosenthal. Josh Rosenthal, our referee. Hi again, everybody. Mike Goldberg alongside Joe Rogan. And we are ready. Gentlemen, you ready? Rich Franklin, you ready? damage. And here we go. Let's fight. Huge left and right. Those are snapping his head back, Mike. We're short, we're short. Don't retreat. Take your time, nice and relaxed. Sometimes it's better to throw shorter, quicker punches, and that's what we're seeing here tonight. When you put all that effort and energy into a punch and you really wind up, it takes more time to reach the fighter. Franklin is cut here, Mike.
combination. And he answers. Oh, but he oh, ate a left hand. Left. And right. again. He loves throwing that punch. Oh, nice left and a right. Nice counter. Fast hands. Good battle inside. Under three minutes now. Oh, big combination. Oh, good counter. Oh, good combination. Away. Left, right. What an exchange here. Oh, oh beautiful combination. He's hurt. Oh, big left hook. That's it. He's out. It is all over. Knockout victory. How good was that? Finishes the fight. Yeah, let's look at it again. There was certainly bad intention when he throws this one. Here we see it again. Instantaneous knockout victory. Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Josh Rosenthal has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes 30 seconds of the very first round, declaring the winner by knockout damage. Sheets. Damage reigns supreme. Matchup between damage and dangerous striker Chuck Liddell. Our tale of the tick is brought to you by UFC Store. The sport lives here. We are now set for the official introductions, and with that, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC middleweight division. Introducing first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of San Luis Obispo, California. He is the former UFC light heavyweight champion, presenting the legendary UFC Hall of Fame octagon warrior, the And now, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Newark, New Jersey. Damage Sheets. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of this contest is Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata, our referee. Mike Goldberg. Are you ready? Are you ready? Chuck Liddell. Damage. And we are underway. Let's go, guys. Joe, the Fight. Iceman Chuck Liddell has had the honor of representing the Ultimate Fighting Championship, the UFC, in Pride, fighting in Japan. He first did it at Pride 14. He fought against Guy Mesger. Uh, we've talked about the battle he had in Pride against Quentin Rampage Jackson. Also against Alistar Overeem, who's also uh, a top light heavyweight and now heavyweight competitor in Japan. 
He is teeing off right now. Beautiful head kick there. Oh, big kick. Oh, good combination. Both guys staying in tight. He's hurt! He's hurt! Somehow he's able to get up. Oh, big shots! They are exchanging here. My I don't know how these guys are still standing. Oh, nice left and a right. Nice punches. And oh, he's he answers. Oh, big combination. Beautiful hook. Oh, we got tagged with a hook. Oh, they're just throwing. Oh, they're exchanging. Big shots. Oh, he's rocked, Mike. Left hook, he's down. Damage finishes the fight. Here we see it one more time. Look at it from this angle. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 30 seconds of the very first round.